can you try and put words to this aesthetic that you um, that maybe isn't defining of the Manhattan now, but is perhaps indicative of where it's come from? Yeah, it's, it's a tough one because, I mean, I could sort of say that's a Malahat story. Although I don't know exactly what right. quality it would be that I am, I, I, I am cottoning on to when I say that. Uh, certainly it has it has something to do with the strength of line. That's, mm-hmm. I mean, that's one of my personal, like, needs if I'm reading it to, to publish a story that it needs to be well written. Um, a certain, like, certain, like, intensity, but not necessarily, not necessarily, like, in, like, bombastic drama. Um, but like an intensity of, of of tension or or stakes maybe, mm. um, although often underplayed, right? Mm. Um, so a sort of subtlety. I think understatement is something okay. that we generally do, but I think I think those are like as as far as like ephemeral qualities that are hard mm-hmm. to articulate. I think certainly that's part of it. Mm-hmm. We on the scale um, between a more traditional short story and. Um, perhaps a more experimental experimental short story, where would you say it falls? Or does it depend on the strength of that individual story? I think that overall, the, the magazine tilts toward uh, more traditional um, storytelling structures, mm-hmm. but that, which doesn't mean at all that we, that we don't publish experimental stuff. Um, and I think part of the, part of the Malahat's evolution recently in the last couple of years has been an attempt to modernize that and right. to, to take on more risky or exciting, not which is not to say that that like traditional stories are exciting. They're they're excellently exciting, um, but just to just to try and shake up the sort of uh, embedded aesthetic preference that we, that the magazine has had, and we still have that, and that's part of the strength of the magazine. Um, but we're just trying to look a little further, maybe. Yeah. And part, like I say, that's 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 partly because of um, the editorial board's makeup. 